The Vietnam War defined a generation. It changed the lives of people who fought in it, those who fought against it, and the families of both. My name is Mike Baltzer. I live in Bismarck, North Dakota, and I was a Sergeant E-5 in the U.S. Army in Vietnam. I was going to college, actually, and uh, I was a senior at NDSU majoring in engineering, and, and of course you were 2S as long as you were in college. And then the lottery came, and then you were all thrown into the big barrel, and I thought, uh, well, this will be interesting, and that was the first time I my number ever came up high in any kind of lottery, and I was number five. Well, then you knew you were pretty well going to go, and so I had a degree in civil engineering. That was another thing I thought, well, the Army and their infinite wisdom will, won't put me in the infantry. I'll be an engineer or something, building bases and that. Well, that wasn't what happened either. I, I, they've, you've got a form that, that you fill out when you're going into into basic and all of that, and it says, what do you like to do? do you, would you go to the symphony or uh, art museum, or do you like to camp out? Well, I picked camp out, and so I got to camp out a lot for the next year. Most of my time was spent in the field, basically patrolling in areas that were supposedly pacified, and, uh, there weren't, and to make sure that there were no Viet Cong and VA, and we would spend 12 days out of 15 out in the bush, we called it, uh, patrolling and looking for enemy and uh, uh, very limited combat, just uh, a couple of minor skirmishes. And uh, then we'd send, spend three days back in the fire support bases. I love the country. I, it was unique. Uh, it was uh, mountainous, not real mountainous like you think of here in the States, but uh, uh, heavily forested uh, streams. It was it was really interesting country, and that's why I really would like to go back and see it again.